Hi there, I'm Cullen from CullenZBCs.com and I have an activity to share with you and it's involving mailboxes and envelopes. Now I left the paper here blank because I thought that you could use it any way that you wanted to and then you could print out as many as you would like to use. This pattern will be on CullenZBCs.com under patterns. You don't need to cut out each individual ones, you could just cut them out in a square like that. Because I know that will take a while to cut out. You don't want to take all that time to do that. You can, of course, if you want. And then cut them out. And then what you could do is you could color these maybe one red, one envelope red, one orange, one orange, one yellow, one yellow. So you could work on color recognition. And you could use it as a matching game or you could hide them around the room and the children have to find the color that matches the, the mailbox that matches with the envelope. Okay. You could also use it for numbers. You could put a number here, a number on the flag, a number wherever you want. And then you could put the same corresponding dot on the envelope. So if it's a one on the mailbox, then you would have one dot. If it's five on the mailbox, then you would have five dots on the envelope. And so then again, you could hide them around the room or you could play a matching game with them when they turn them over, turn two over and try and find the matching pair, okay? So you could also do letters as well. You could do capital letters on one and then lowercase letters on the other. Talk about the letter that it is and the sound that it makes. You could use it in a variance of ways. And I hope that you enjoy this idea and that you have fun using it. And I would love to hear how it goes. If you had fun playing it with it or the children have fun ideas on how to play it. Sometimes kids come up with greater ideas than we have. And I would love to hear all those ideas. I hope you have fun and have a great day. Bye.